Hi, I'm Phoebe Collings-James, an artist from London, and I'm about to take part in the net porte Fashion Challenge. Wish me luck. Challenge number one. You're working in the studio all day, but seeing a friend for a meal that evening. What do you wear to ensure you're comfortable for work, but ready for your dinner date later? Okay, so usually comfortable for work for me means either completely covered in clay or working from home in my pyjamas. Getting something that's good for both of those might be a little bit challenging, but I'm going to try my best. Let's see what we've got. Dressing for my studio. I would definitely need something that was quite durable. How about these? I think these would work. Maybe a top that was quite simple and classic. Something like this. Would look really cute. Which way around does this go? Then maybe something to put on top to hide any clay patches or mess that I might have made. A silk number. Okay, so I'm gonna take these two and the trench coat and I'm gonna try them on. Oh, this looks good. Very glamorous, but maybe, maybe it doesn't need it. Okay, I think this is great. I love the color. Maybe just need some shoes to go with it. Okay, these are great, nice and chunky. So I think now I will just need a bag, something that I can fit all of my stuff in from the studio and that also looks cute for the evening. Maybe I would go for this Chloe one. Let's have a look. Yeah, I think this is cute. Perfect for studio, perfect for dinner. I think I'm ready for this date. Challenge number two. You've been invited to a friend's birthday party, but he lives overseas. So you offer to do a virtual DJ set from your home instead. Show us your party ready outfit. My initial thoughts are that it needs to be something that's quite fabulous on top because you probably won't see my lower half. And I don't know, that my friend is a very lucky person. <laughs> Maybe glittery or has some kind of shiny element to it. Something like that could work nicely. It's a bit 80s. This I love. All things gold and chained and shiny. I think this could be perfect. I just need something to wear on my bottom. Although usually if I'm on a video call, I'll probably just be wearing my underwear. Not gonna be right for dancing in if I get really in the mood, but it's quite gorgeous. These could work. Okay, I'm gonna try these on. Well, this is very sophisticated, even more so than I usually would do for a DJ set, but I think it's perfect. Some shoes. It's gonna have to be these ones. These are absolutely gorgeous. I'm obsessed with Nets jewelry. I guess more is more when it comes to gold. And then maybe a bracelet. Which one? Gold. At home, I'm usually in this sort of position bopping around. <laughs> I look so much more put together than I ever have done for a DJ set, but I think I look pretty fabulous and ready to go. So challenge number three, you're heading to a small gallery opening in your neighborhood. What do you wear to your first ever event post lockdown? Okay, well, I think I'm gonna be probably very nervous about seeing lots of people and wanting to feel easy and relaxed. What do we have here? Blazer? What about a dress? Maybe this one. I like the pleating. It's a pretty color. It's got pockets. I'm gonna try it on. Okay, fab, I really like this. I was a bit intimidated by how fluffy it is, but I think it works, especially with these pockets. Maybe some trainers. These are great. I basically wear trainers all the time, so it's not really a big move, but it always makes me feel comfortable. And now I think I need some jewelry just so I can feel extra fab. I think I'm gonna go for this Chloe bracelet. It's got really beautiful detailing on it. it looks super gorgeous. A cute bag. Maybe this one. It could be my like small safety blanket for when I get really scared about all the people. Yeah, I think that works. So that was my net porte fashion challenge. I'm out of here. <laughs> <laughs>